Hi, it's Simon here again from uh, Constable States Winery here in Niagara on the Lake. Today we're downstairs in the cellar. The first one we're going to be doing of the four S's is the smell. So put your nose and have a nice smell. Making sure there's no kind of wet dog smell, that actually happens when you when the cork can affect the wine itself, like a nail varnish remover or something like that. Okay, so the second S is the swirl. It's going to be a good swirl like that. Again, okay, that's called swirl. You actually put humouring the wine. Humouring actually means you're actually folding air into, like kneading bread. So you're actually holding it, the flavours coming around. It kind of coats the side as well. So the third S that we're going to be doing is the smelling again. The reason why we've done that, we've actually aerated the wine itself by swirling it. So you smell again, and it should change the flavour. If it doesn't, you can tell your server that this wine has been open for far too long. Okay, so the uh, fourth of the S's is the savour. All right, so we'll put it into the mouth here, and we'll a little taste of this. So basically, when you actually say, when you actually pour the decanter or an aerator, you're actually enhancing the flavours as well. So the first sip is always never your true sip. Think of it more like an alcoholic mouthwash that you can swallow. <laughs> you can make millions out of that. But basically, it's your second or your third sip. Just like a book, you never judge a book by its cover. The same thing with wine. It's your second or your third sip. All right, so my name's Simon, Simon Bentall from Consumer States Winery here in Niagara-on-the-Lake and uh, thank you for watching.